Hey there, so here's a quick guide on how to get a pet companion in Disney Dreamland Valley. Now, all critters in the valley are able to be turned into pets and the way it works is actually pretty simple. All you need to do is to approach them and feed them their favorite food and eventually they will be friendly enough to become your pet companion. Now you can head over to the companion tab located right at the wardrobe area and that is where you can find all of the available critters that is ready to be your pet. Now this might sound easy in itself but here are some things that most people don't even know about. Number 1. Critters have a hidden friendship bar. This is why it is important to feed them their favorite food to make sure that they eat and of course, the hidden friendship bar being raised faster. Hence, you get to turn them into your pets as soon as possible. Number 2. You cannot feed the same critter for more than once per day. So if you're wondering why you couldn't feed them anymore, just wait more than a day for them to respawn and then you'll be able to feed them once again, furthering increase their hidden friendship bar. Number 3. Every critters are unique and not the same. For example, the black rabbit and the white rabbit are a separate kind and they do not share the same hidden friendship bar. So if you want to get the white rabbit as your pet companion, you will have to make sure to feed the very same white rabbit in another day. Just a heads up, you can always head into the critter section under collections and see if your specific critter is spawned in for the day. Number 4, there will be special critters available in the valley that you can get but most of them will be either time limited, obtained from friendship quests or participating in some events. For example, the Incredible Squirrel can only be acquired by redeeming it from the Pixar Fest event. So if you miss this one out, you may not have the chance to get it anymore until they reintroduce it in the near future. Another example is the Celestial Turtle which can only be obtained by purchasing the Deluxe Edition of the game and the Real Fox which can only be obtained by getting the Ultimate Edition of the game. More of these special pets will definitely be introduced in the near future so do keep a lookout for that if you love gathering them. Number 5. Not everyone can become your companion at the same speed. Now for the case of rabbits and squirrels, you will only need to feed them twice considering you're feeding them their favorite food and they will be able to become your companion after that. However, for others like foxes and sunbirds for example, this will require more than two feeding sessions to be able to turn them into companions since they have a longer friendship bar. So don't be surprised if it's taking a little bit longer than usual, just keep at it and they will eventually fall for you. And this is also why it is extremely important to feed them their favorite food in order to maximize the amount of EXP gain for their friendship and minimize the amount of time taken to turn them into pets. But yeah, there you have it, all you need to do is to approach them the right way and to feed them their favorite food. And in order to help you reach there faster, click on the video you see on the screen right now to find out exactly what are all of the critters favorite food and the best way to approach them. This will definitely help your journey in gathering as many pets as possible as fast as you can. This is the Viperion signing off, thanks for watching and as always stay awesome and I will see you in the next video.